Hey guys, Rastam here, and today we're back again with GTA San Andreas 100% completion master save. Our previous time, we made our way into Los Venturas proper and did just about every single side mission possible. Now, today I'm going to start off by helping out Woozy. That's for a specific reason. Idiot! Do you realize how much those machines cost? We're supposed to be opening it. What the fuck was that? Hello? Hello? <clears throat> What the fuck is wrong with you people? Boss, CJ's here. Carl, glad you can make it. So, this what you've been doing? Yeah, it's been a complete nightmare. You want a stomach ulcer? Try opening a triad casino in a mafia-run town. The mob trying to squeeze you? Yeah, the corporations are moving in and everybody's feeling the squeeze. I've had slot machines busted up, workmen being scared off. So who behind this? Huh? Well... There are these three mob families operating here, and each of them has a stake in Caligula's casino. And some whacked-out lawyers running it for them. It could be any one of them. Or all of them. Can't you just give them a little something? No. In addition to the usual authorities that need bribing, each one would want a slice. And I'm not about to hand over all our profits to some wise guy Italians. Our profit? That's right, you heard me. I want to offer you a share in our casino. In exchange for some help setting it up. How's that sound, partner? Sound like we got a deal then. Boss, the boys found some thugs trying to smash one of the deliveries. We caught one of them. Get rid of him. Hey, wait, hold up, hold up, come here. Whoever's behind this, we need to let them know that they're dealing with full-fledged psychos. <laughs> Time to the front of the car, let them sweat it out a little. And I'll be out there in a little while. See if we can make this guy squeal. That's my call. Hey, hey, who the fuck? Who are you? One timey, huh? You know what? I think we're gonna take a little drive. What are you, fucking stupid? I'm not joking here. Untie me, motherfucker. Nah, I think I'm gonna leave you right where you are. You got any idea in that pea brain head of yours who the fuck I am? Nah, <laughs> but I think I'm gonna find out. Alright, so all you gotta do is scare him a bit. Driving on the wrong side of the roads, oh, doing stunt jumps, and breaking a lot. Does that, but head-on collisions will kill him though, so I gotta be kind of careful. One of the easiest ways to do this mission is just like, go like this, constantly. And just keep the speed up a bit. Alright, there we go, almost there. And there we go. So yeah, nice and easy mission, real quick to do as well. Sound of a hole in one. Great shot, boss. Thanks. Not bad, Woolsey. So, the Sindaco family was behind the attempts to sabotage our venture. I wonder why it's only them and not the others. Probably ain't just them. Rule of the streets, don't snitch. What we need is to hit the Mafia Casino. Yeah, go jack the place. Hey, hitting a casino isn't like gangbanging. It's a whole different league. Yeah, you right. It'll take some planning, but I'm down. She always wanted to pull a heist. What the? Ah, bad luck. Listen, you're gonna need a crew and some special equipment. Yeah, it'll take some explosives. Always gotta blow up shit to pull a heist. You know what? There's an open cast mine southwest of the city limits. They must have explosives. 
I'll go peep it out. All right, let's go to the quarry. All right, it should be fairly easy. I'm just going to run like this to avoid any fall damage. Oh shit. Well, there goes that plan. Also, I do have a timer, but I'm pretty sure if I just shoot this guy. There we go. There goes the timer. Nice and easy. Not that, like, this is very much doable within that time. But this just makes things a bit easier. Who's this asshole? I can just run that over. Pick up the dynamite. Oh, that's dangerous. Get back in here. Get stick number two. Doing. Stick number three is over there, and I'll pick it up in a moment. First up, let me just get this one as well. Not sure what blew up there, doesn't matter. Stick number three, and now it's just one more stick left. Who's this asshole? And stick number four. Nice and easy. All right, time to go home, provided nothing bad happens. All right, sadly, they blocked the exit and the guys over there have shotguns and have like a ridiculously good aim. So to avoid all that, just gonna escape by here. Kill you. Oh, let's not mess this up. Because we can just go from here. Up here. Uh, I was hoping to make that jump. Sadly not. Oh well. Yeehaw. Oop, nearly messed up there. Uh oh. And now through here. Um, oh, right, yeah. And over here we go. Perfect. And luckily the drop-off point is fairly close by. Delivery for wolves. Hey, you be careful with that. Alright, and that's that mission complete. As you saw at the top left, the fact that I just robbed the quarry of dynamite means that I can now work there. Because obviously that's how employment works. And the quarry missions are actually the final missions that I need to do in order to officially gain 100% completion. So let's do them. Alright, just need to use the bulldozer. Just... Clear the path. So that's one. Right, 
keep moving. These missions are actually kind of fun because they have quite some variety to them. Unlike, say, uh, the taxi missions or whatever. These ones are actually quite different all from each other. So another one right there. Well, let's hope I don't mess up. No, we're good. Whew. Oh, come on. There we go. Just gonna go up here, because from what I see at the marker, there's like two here. So I might as well go for these two first. Okay, gotta roll this one right over here. Okay, we're good. So yeah, it's a calm start to this episode, but that's fine. And everything has to be fast and bombastic. Sometimes you just gotta put in the work. final one with more than enough time to spare. There we go. Ooh, okay, this time I have to push bombs away apparently. Ooh, the timer on this is quite something. That's okay. Just gotta push it like this. Now just like that. Okay, luckily I get some more time. <laughs> Oof, okay, and the bombs do explode. Which makes sense, obviously. Oh, wow, well, I have to actually... Okay, go back. That's fine. And I have to roll it up the hill, apparently. Gotta be careful not to push it off the side, then. Right, there we go. Careful. Careful. There we go. Just go back, forward. Nope. Oh. Careful. Okay, that works. Just gotta do it like this now. And the next one is in between the crushers. Oh, get out, get out, get out. <sighs> okay. Close one there. Game really screwed me at the end, but it worked out. Bombers are escaping a dumper. Oh, okay. Just gonna make my way to them. 
This one's ridiculously easy, because I'm not entirely sure what they expected you to do here. Because it's, it's literally just a drive-by mission, and their vehicle's incredibly fragile. So all I gotta do is just get next to it. Oh, come on now. One more shot. Ah, oh, damn it. Problem is, if I get too close now while I'm shooting, I'm worried that I might explode with them. This seems to be good. There we go. And good night. Bombers have been caught. The bodies are loaded on a dumper at the quarry's other entrance. Oh, okay. So we just need to get to the other entrance then. Shit, how do we get there again? <laughs> okay, really wasted a lot of time here, but that's fine. Yeah, oof, I'm gonna have to be very quick now. Wow, those cop models sure look uh, interesting, to say the least. You can waste it like a full minute and a half here, so. Follow the tracks. Uh, nah. I'd rather just do this. Okay, good. No, 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 no. Okay, that counted for some reason. Alright, sure, I guess I'm close enough to the fire for that to count. I'll just lower these guys in there. There we go. Dumpers loaded with explosives. It needs to be driven gently. Uh oh, okay, sure, I can do that. To the desert airstrip. Alright, no worries. I'm good at gently driving. Oh, careful, okay. It's over there already, so just don't mess up now. Bit of a steep angle to approach from, but it should be fine. <sighs> careful. Okay, yeah, we're good, we're good. Alright, drop the barrels, the soft sand will, will prevent an explosion. Okay, well, hope that's true. Alright, there we go. Dumper has its load and explosives all along train tracks. Ooh, okay. The train arrives in a few minutes, apparently. So gotta be fast. Alright, there they are. Could I, in theory, right? Just like grab these like this. Like all at once and just push them. There we go. Yeah, that seems to work. I mean, those all don't count anymore, so. So just. There we go. Okay, only a few more to go. Okay, that one's gone. One little bit more. 
Not just this one left. There we go. Train is approaching. Where? I've never seen a train go so fast in my life. Cop has been killed. Alright, gotta use a bulldozer in the quarry this time. Get rid of the body. Should be doable. So just get in here. Push the body and the bike towards the crane pickup area over there. Okay. Okay. Just push it onwards. There we go. Now just the body. Right, there we go. This should be good. Alright, now I gotta get to that crane. Up. Ooh, okay. Gotta unload it back into there. Use the shadow to make sure I line it up right. There we go. And there we go. Okay. Time to get into the dumper. Now just gotta drive carefully to the quarry entrance. I can do that. Oop, nearly fell off there, but we're good. I just gotta dump them both into the water. Boo, careful. Don't let the dumper truck follow the bike and the body. Okay, I can do that. Just boop. Uh, okay, now we're good, we're good, we're good. That should be good enough. There we go. Oh, that's all quarry missions complete. Thought there would be more actually. Now I've acquired it as an asset. Wow, two thousand! Holy shit! At this point, for 100% completion, all I have to do is finish up the main story. But of course there's still a few things here and there that I want to do regardless. Gotta do something before I forget it. Because so over here, there's this woman. Hi, I'm divorced with two kids. Still interested? Yeah, call me soon. Great, I'll give you a call. My name is Barbara, by the way. There we go. But Katie does it for if you get wasted. Barbara does for what's uh, busted, so you get to keep all your weapons and all that from now on. Let's go ahead and help Torvino again, and see what he wants from us this time. Get you again, Carl! You're half asleep. I could have killed you in nine different ways. Wake up and smell the coffee. You need to lay off the coffee. We got a problem. I got some guys out in the field need some equipment. If they don't get it, they'll be dead by nightfall. Then take it to them! Me take it to them? Yeah, why not? I got five guys watching me all the time. I got two in that hill, one over there, and two by satellite. If I go, my guys and I will be dead. I don't have a death wish. I'm a man of peace, son. Yeah, clearly. Take the plane. Now, you're not ready yet, so stay low under the radar. Questions? Yeah, just one thing. Get to I... it. Wait, hey, listen. Listen to me for once. Why won't these guys come after me? Oh, they can't, because they're all posted on me. One DEA, one FBI, a Russian, a Cuban double agent, and my paymasters. Checks and balances. Nobody is watching anybody watching nobody. Know what I mean? Go. Whatever, man. So 
so it's just a flying mission. So I gotta stay close to the ground, otherwise I have a problem. As you can see right there. That's fine though. I'm just gonna fly this thing across the map and back. Smooth and simple. i to avoid the mountains if I can, so I'm just gonna go from here. Honestly, if I were to just fly over the mountain, that'd probably be a good idea. That's fine. I will. Go. Oh. Yeah, the popping can be a problem sometimes, especially with the larger trees and the rocks and all that. <sighs> okay. Alright, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Uh, let's find. <sighs> okay. We're good, we're good, we're good. Didn't even worry for a second there. Okay, there's the corona. As soon as I fly through there, we're good. There we go. Alright, now all I gotta do is just fly my way back. Cargo dropped, everything is safe. Alright, smooth and simple. Now. Just need to land it. Nice going, Carl. Really. There we go. Ah, what's Torino up to now? I'm feeling a little exposed here. What's your take on this? Damn! I thought them was your people. Listen, Carl, we've got a problem. Some traitors from another department think they can help the overseas situation by financing militaristic dictators in exchange for arms contracts. Hey, ain't that exactly what you do? Well, kind of, but we get to pick our dictators. Degenerates that we can control. We try to stay the hell away from these guys of principles, because that just muddies the waters. Yeah, okay. Okay, so... Of course, these idiots have stolen a consignment of landmines and they plan to offload them in the Middle East and cause a little rocket and Ariel's crazy and have a lot of problems. I mean, Carl, do you like maiming people? I'm just curious. Maiming? Some people? Shit. Anyway, the point is, you and me, Carl, hey, we're the same. Now, yeah, it's a dirty job, but somebody's got to do it. But if you screw this up, it causes a tinderbox situation all over Latin America and the Middle East. Now, look, I spoke to the big man. You got clearance to eliminate these fuckers. How's that? Huh? Man, kill government agents? <laughs> kill Schmidl. Come on, don't, don't look at it that way. We <laughs> think of it as pest control. It works for me. All right, come on. I can't stay here now. I'm too hip. I gotta go. Okay? I'm out of here. All right. It's a very iconic mission, because now I just need to get into the plane as quickly as I can before it takes off. So just go from here. Just ignore those guys. Don't get hit by the barrels. That's fine. Come on. There we go. You 
Alright, so the game's all like, oh, don't fire weapons on board, because then you're gonna get screwed, but it's completely fine, as long as you're ca careful. So I'm just getting a silenced pistol, because that's it. And like I said, as long as you're careful, you should be completely fine. So I can just run over here. Uh oh. I guess chill. There we go. Them all taken out. Ooh, now before I forget. One satchel charge. And now let's just get the hell out of here. Oh fine, you wanna get your ass kicked too? Sure. There we go. Alright, take care guys. I'm out of here. It's probably the most stylish mission path screen in the entire game. So I'm pretty sure uh, we're like way above the height limit in this game. So you know what? I don't think CJ actually needs this parachute. So, uh, yeah. There we go, perfectly fine. Now we can just go and eat in this fast food restaurant here to regain our health. And in case you're wondering what the hell just happened, uh, when you reach max health in this game, you can survive pretty much any fall from any height whatsoever with just the tiniest sliver of health left. CJ miraculously always survives no matter what. Catalina, hey, I know it's you. What's eating you, baby? I don't love you no more. Well, hey, that's just hello. Torino, where are you? Wrong devil, CJ. True! How are you? <laughs> In better shape than you, fat ass. What? Hey, you watching me? Can't talk now. I need your help for something special. Come back here when you've lost some weight, Fatso. I'll be waiting. Hey, man, what the... Dang! I ain't that chubby. Hail, fellow, well met. Namaste. Peace, Carl, my brother. Hey, Troop, where you at? Just checking that you are no longer on government business. Where is he? How the fuck would I know, man? He like the devil. Hey, man, you okay? Everything is transient. Whoa, man. Oh. I'm passing through life same as every man. Okay. Do you have any idea what you're doing for Torino? Nah, I seem to be on the need to know basis. Oh, no, man. Two lies don't cancel each other out. You know that. We pay them to lie to us. Is that what our founding fathers wanted? No more, friend. No more. We're not alone. Get off me, man. What's going on? Everything is going on. Don't you get it? There's a place, not even on the map. A train is about to leave. It can explain better than I ever can. Boy, this is going to blow your fucking mind. We got work to do. You better drive. I'll explain. The elegance does not even touch it.
Hey, true. Do we have a plan here? Go, go, go! Hey, hold up, dude! So if you thought the game went kind of kind of jumped the shark with the whole Torino business and the secret agent stuff, this is the part where it like does a triple backflip off the shark. So, first up, just gotta be careful. It's a sneaky mission. Good. Damn it. Can I just. There we go. Just to be safe. Possible intruder sighted. Condition blue. Set searchlights to tracking mode. Uh oh. How oh, did you see me? Well, that was fun while it lasted. Oh well, try my best. Hop. Right, so I, I just I could sneak my way through it, but I'm pretty sure I, I just have to like shoot my way through it. So I have to deactivate the rocket defenses and all that, otherwise I'm screwed. Oh, hello, minigun. Yeah, don't mind if I do. There we go. Hi there. Goodbye there. Oh, where'd you come from? Anyway. Nice and easy. To so calmly walk my way through here. Okay, thanks. Just gotta use the pass card. Now, could I just, in theory, right, just jump my way down? Okay, yeah, that probably wasn't the smartest idea. Oh well. Hell out of here. Right. Bye guys, thanks for the cool ass jetpack. I like how like casual CJ as well, stealing a jetpack by the way. Anyway. Carl, dude, man. Hey, here you go. You better stash it somewhere fast. Far out, have a nice trip, dude. Hey, wait a- 
Ah, was it too much to ask to get a lift in the town? There we go. Mission passed. Nice and easy. Hey, Carl. It's me, the truth. We got a date with Destiny, man. In about five minutes. Where you at? At the old airplane graveyard you've been hanging around. I think this is the final truth mission. Damn, where is this fool? The new age begins here. Say what? Not all fantastic things are lies, Carl. Today we'll know everything. Oh, I can hardly wait. I hear knowledge is truly sacred in this part of the world. Man, I've tried, but I can't fight for shit. You better do it. Land on the train, kill the guards, get in and steal the stuff. Oh, yeah? What stuff? I don't know yet. Oh, <laughs> you don't know yet. I was starting to think you was a lunatic. What you mean you don't know yet? You'll be stealing the answer. Look, fly the jetpack, land on the train, and steal whatever they least want us to get. Shh. Listen. They're coming. We better go. Peace on Earth, dude. Right, so I just have to fly this jetpack to the train. Grab something very non-specific. In fact, I don't think we ever get an answer, so don't get your hopes up. Drive to the train. Okay, careful. But can I just let go of this thing now? No, I cannot. Okay, that's fine. Come on, there we go. Oh, well, that one's empty. Boo. Also empty, of course it is. There we go. I'll be taking this. And now time to take it back to the truth. Nice and easy. Wait, there's still one guy left alive. Might as well, right? I was hoping I could like show off my amazing aim, but no, I just embarrassed myself. There we go. No witnesses. You got it, man? I got something. Let me see. Ooh. Everything is different now. What is it? Everything. They will call this Year Zero. I'll be in touch. Wait! What is... Yeah, see you around. There we go. I believe that's all the missions here done for now. So let's move on into the city. Alright, let's see what else we can do now for Woozy. Hit me. Are you sure, man? Yeah, I'm going for a five card hand. Come on. Okay. Here. I'm a stick. What you got? How would I know? You tell me. Not good, man. You got a uh, 47. Damn. You're bad luck for me, you know? When I play the other guys, I always win. Boss. Take a look at these two chips. One's a fake. That's amazing. You didn't even touch him. Nah, I just took a guess. Why else would he come in with two chips and sound so worried? You take a look. Oh, yeah, the dragon on this got the sunglasses and a white stick. Insolent bastards! 
I'll make sure the cashiers are extra vigilant. It's obvious where these chips are coming from. The Sindaco family owns a plastics factory across town. I'm gonna blow it to shit! Man, look, don't trip. I got you on this. So I just gotta get to this factory and put a stop to it. Alright, here we are. Excellently shot there, but whatever. Hey, who's this prick? Somebody take care of this joker. Oh shit. That's fine. Just gotta play this carefully. Okay, that guy did a lot of damage. <laughs> Holy shit. That's fine though. And just take everyone out here. Now I'm just gotta shoot all these printers. Wait, I have a minigun. Should probably use that instead. There we go. Blow that up and set. There we go. Yeah, it works. Oh, boo. Oh, there's more of them. That's fine. Last one. Why am I using this anyway? Oh well. Oh wait, that one already broke. It was this one. <laughs> there we go. Nice and easy. Ooh, one guy over there. Oh shit, he had a combat shot in. Okay, well, glad I took him out. Alright, back to the casino. Now time for the most awkwardly placed line ever, which is 100% recorded after the rest. Hey Carl, how'd it go? Tell Woozy we'll be getting no more trouble with them counterfeit chips. Yeah, you can definitely hear the counterfeit chips part was added in after, which is kind of funny. CJ, hey Troop, is that you? Might be. Might be a government algorithm trying to pick your brain, so don't admit anything. Whatever, man. What's up? I need a favor, Carl. Thought I could cash in some karma chips. Your credit good? I took some fellow travelers deep into the desert on a peyote safari a few nights back. We faced the inner light and communed with the Lizard King. Sound fun. How'd it go? That's the problem. I don't know. I'm in Los Santos. I woke up at a Japanese bathhouse about an hour ago. I have no idea how I got here or where the others are. They're probably fine. I don't think so. They were Brits, a band, and their managers. They have no experience about the desert. Okay. Where'd you make camp? I can go have a look. I took them up Marco del Oeste. Fantastic sunsets. Best start looking for them up there. All right, just gotta find a few guys. Here we are. Hello. Hey, anybody out here? The truth sent me. Hey, over there. Hey, man, you all right? Kin hell, I'm fucking hanging. Stone me, bloody crows. Oh, where am I? I don't know, mate. I was having a dream. I was wanking up with some fat bird's tits when this twat turned up. Maka, you fucking psycho. You did it again, didn't ya? That peyote was shite. You are lucky I brought some tabs along. I told you a million times not to put stuff in my fucking drink. Oh, piss off, kidder. Who are you again? 
Oh, I'm a friend of the truth. He said you guys might need a ride into town or something. But I'm a fucking raspberry. You're not a fucking raspberry. I can't feel my legs, RP. I've wanked the use out of them. Just stand up, you soppy cunt. We go through this every weekend. Oh, woo. Man, what the hell was y'all doing last night? Anybody got a rag? Uh, so where I'm taking y'all? I got a pal, Rosie. He's got some casino gig going down in Ventura. Sweet. All right. Fuck off, String. Oh, charming. All right, ladies, let's go. Come on, fucking Northerners. Well, it felt like I couldn't feel them honest. Right, well, these two guys are lovely. Uh, oh, a vehicle with at least two passenger seats. Right. You okay, guys, wait here. I'll find something. Wait, kiddo, wait! There we go. Now, off to the snake farm. So where's the rest of the band, guys? Maka, where are the boys? I don't fucking know, do I? I remember snakes. Lots of snakes. It's a snake farm not too far from here. We can go check Oof, out. Okay. You look as pale as a drowned baby, man. Oh, oh god. Oh, I think I'm gonna chuck. P, what you need is some food down your... <coughs> a fried egg sarnie with mayonnaise will sort it. <coughs> and what about a pickled egg? And what about a pickled egg? Looks just like sulfur to me. What are you talking about? Take a gander at him, fellas. Is that him? That there city boy has gone and been with my prize hog. Now I don't even get no sugar from her. And that one done screwed my sis. I had a terrible aching in my grinds ever since. I'm gonna slap you silly for giving me and my fella the red bumpies. What in tarnation? I'm a fixin' to give you a whooping for what you gone and done to my young Oh shit. Everybody in the car. There we go, no witnesses. I think you're just supposed to run away there, but you know, whatever. Seems you boys had a good time. Hey, what about the band? We'll just have to pray they've made it to civilization. Keep all this and drummers at ten a penny a week. Which casino is it? It's called Caligulus. It's on the strip somewhere, I think. Come on, then. Let's go in and see Rosie. Kent Paul, here to see Rosie. Hey, boss, there's somebody here to see you. Oh, go away. I have a migraine. Oh, Rosie, son, it's me, Paolo. Oh, God. My despair is complete. Okay, let him in. Rosie, how are you, me old son? I pray that one day I can escape my perpetual torment and retire in peace and comfort a million miles away from anyone I've ever fucking known, and instead, I get this? Come on, it's me, Kent Poe. Well, hello, Pa. What a pleasant surprise. Who the hell are these guys? These are my boys, Maka and Carl, sir. You are any speckled dogs, boss? I'm peeking on one right now. Top of the range, man. <laughs> well, it's fitting as I sit here up to my neck in a river of shit with every mafia gorilla from Liberty City to Los Santos pissing in my face that you, Kent Paul, should witness it. What's the matter, son? Too numerous. Impressively insurmountable and depressingly fucking typical, even to mention. It's all right, bruv. Paolo can help. Give us some space, would you, son? I'll give you a tinkle later. All right, for sure. Not you, Macca. Oh, you twat. Unbelievable. Hey, Woolsey. I think I found a way to scope Caligula's casino without causing too much suspicion. We could talk later. There we go, and it gives a way in to Caligula's casino. Speak on it. Alright, Carl, it's me, Paolo. Listen, Rose is in a tangle, and I think you're the geezer to sort it out for us, okay, sunshine? 
Slip round the office and see me, double quick. Yeah, thanks, man. I appreciate the opportunity. Let's see what we can do for him. Oi, Rosie, liven yourself up. Carl's here. <sighs> Hello. What's happening? Hey, you some top funny down at that pool, pubs, eh? Well, leave it out, Dimlo. What's wrong with you? Well, are you going to tell him or shall I? I'm really screwed. Crack on, Rosie. Spit it out. I threw it all away. Okay, I had the power, the money, the ladies, but I couldn't lay off the blow. So I went into rehab and everything went to shit, but so what? So when I came out, I started representing the Liberty City mob again. And that's how I ended up here. But no one family would trust another family to run the casino. So I was put forth as a neutral party. So now I spend my days waiting for one family to cap me and blame the other one. My only friend is a bird named Tony. I never fucked anyone over in my life who didn't have it coming to him. Shit, let me think about this. You're going to have to break it down for me real quick. Okay, okay. The Sindakos are on the warpath. Okay, I mean, something terrible something has happened to Johnny. I mean, he's in a shock-induced coma at the hospital across town. Now, the Ferrellis, they will take this opportunity to rub him out. Now, if any hit between the families succeeds on my turf, I will get the axe, bullet, machete. Okay, whatever. okay, relax. I'm going to shoot over to the hospital and move the body or something. There you go, my love. Things ain't so bad, are they? <sighs> Bada bang! Giant Sinako is the guy we put in the hospital. <laughs> so here I am, about to try and rescue some guy that's scared half to death. If he wake up through all this, I'm screwed. I'm sure it'll be fine. Nothing to worry about. Just gotta hope he doesn't, you know, wake up or anything. Hello, sir. Can I help you? Yeah, I'm here to pick up Mr. Sindaco. Mr. Sindaco? There must be some mistake. An ambulance just picked him up. Oh, okay. Thank you for your help. Gonna find the one containing Jai. So there's one over there, one over there, and one all the way over there. Okay, I'm gonna go to the first one on the right first. Okay. So not this one. Seriously? That's yeah, gonna be fine. Just gotta find the one they've actually taken. There we go. Okay. Just gotta make it spin out. Oh wait, I have nitros, right? No. That's fine. No, we need to go the other way. That's fine. Okay, now I'm gonna ram him. Probably shouldn't shoot him though, because I don't want it to blow up. Come on. Can I just... There we go. Alright, who's messing with Ferrelli business? Yeah, who's got a death wish? Good, there we go. Not my car, you know. I just have to take him back. Smooth and simple. I mean, he doesn't really look unconscious, he's just sitting in the back, but go on. Ooh, okay, there does seem, actually seem to be someone following me. Aside from the cops, that is. But that's fine. Because I should be able to outrun him. 
If I just go like this. Yeah, these guys arrived way too late because I'm pretty much already here anyway. I see the light. Oh no, you don't. Hey, Johnny, how you feeling? I didn't think he was gonna be discharged till tomorrow. Now we've got more missions, including apparently a new tenpenny mission. All right, what's next? The meat business. The good doctor has revived the patient. You, sweet has my you, son. Sweet, so I be dang straight now. No, absolutely not. I'm still screwed. Absolutely screwed. But at least now I'm in the right frame of mind. <laughs> what the fuck are we gonna do? Any minute now, some mafia bullet is going to splatter my brains all over the wall. My wall. My beautiful wall. Ooh, you missed a bit. I love that. Forget about it. Oh, that's a great idea, Tony. But you know what? It ain't gonna work, okay? Not this time. No way, no way. Look, man, relax. Get a grip. Yeah, you're right. I need to get a grip. Take control. Yes. Grab the bull by the horn. And show everybody who's boss. I'm the boss. I am the boss. All right, then. All right. Let's tear this down. That's what off. I'm saying. <laughs> so where we going? Details! Details! Let's just get there! Rack them up, Mako. What's the matter with you? Right. So we're going to... Apparently my car despawned, but that's fine. See how Johnny has win him over with some... <laughs> kind words during his convalescence. Well, yeah, sure. I can take you by there. Okay, great. We need a car. I gotta get out of this game. Shit, my nose is pissing like a racehorse. That is really good stuff. Drive faster, would you please? Come on, come on, come on. What do you want, old lady? So you trying to get out? Yes, God, yes. I want to do something safe and legal and boring with people that like me. And have a wife and some kids and get divorced and fight for weekend access like everybody else. Listen, I'll see what I can do. Thanks, I'm just so tired of all this life and death bullshit. <laughs> Ah, shit, shit's all down my damn shirt and everything. Uh, it's my best shirt, too. Doesn't this shirt look good on me? It's gonna be a bit awkward, I think, if Johnny sees CJ again, but I'm sure it'll all work out. Okay, let's get this over with. I'm the boss. I am the boss. I'm the boss. I am the boss. Yeah. Yeah. What's going on? Did you forget something? No, look, you go on in. I'm awake. Uh, look, you gotta come with me this once. If I pull this off, I can carry on. I know I can, but please, you gotta come with me. I, I, I'm i gonna squirt my ass all over the floor. Just this once, please. Please, please. Okay, please. okay, chill. <laughs> Shit, this can't look good. Listen, everything gonna be okay. Just remember, you the boss. I'm the boss? I'm the boss. I'm the boss. I'm the boss! I am the boss. Hey, boys. Tell your boss that Ken Rosenberg is here to see him. Ken who? K K Ken Rosenberg. <gasps> Ken Rosenberg, the guy that runs this town. So, uh, how's Johnny? Yeah, he's doing much better. Huh. Yeah. He ate something this morning. Oh. Huh. Mm -hmm. Hey, Ken. Oh. <laughs> Ken, come on, stay. How you doing? Pretty good. And you? Ah, I still got a little bit of the night terrors, uh, <laughs> touch of diarrhea, but I'll get through it. Huh? Diarrhea? Cool. And yeah. uh, who's this? How you doing, Johnny? It's fucking him. It's him. Oh, oh my head. Oh god, it's him. It oh, my heart. My heart. Would you believe it didn't end well? Shit! 
They started a fire to keep us back. There must be an extinguisher here somewhere. Fine. Or I'll leave no witnesses or we're dead meat. I got the extinguisher. I got the extinguisher. Take those guys out and I'll throw out the flames. I mean, I'm fireproof, so, you know. Stand back. Okay, I'm not actually getting, this isn't because of the fire, it's because Ken right now is just putting the extinguisher stuff in my face, so I can't like really do anything right now. I can't even move actually. There we go. Okay, again. <laughs> Thanks, Ken. Appreciate it. There was a lot of them, actually. Okay, can't allow them to go for Ken. What did I say? What did I do? No, my bad. Now take cover. Holy fuck! What is it about my luck? You think I'm? Oh hi! Where did you come from? I'm working on it, don't worry. Okay, it's clear. Well done, CJ. This ain't too classy. Shit, that surprised me. Just gotta be careful when guys with combat shots don't show up. There we go. Alright, can get in. Shit, we gotta get the fuck out of here. We need some wheels. Get me back to Caligula's. You calm down and follow my lead. Holy fuck, man. We work well as a team together, huh, CJ? You and me tearing this town up? Nobody can stop us. Nobody in the world. Johnny's a done deal, and so is his gang. Too fucking right they are, dumb pussies. Oh, fuck, I'm screwed. I'm fucking screwed. What the fuck am I gonna do? Shit, shit, shit! You just gotta hang in there. Play it dumb. I'll figure out a Come way on, to get asshole. you out of here. Just drop me at the airport. Nah, man. They gotta think you did. I'll think of something. I promise. It's safe and sound. Back at the casino. Get in there and be cool. Like you've just been out for a relaxing drive or something. Come. Yeah, come. I'm come. Real fucking calm. I'm calm, Mr. Calm, Mr. Calm. That's me, Mr. Calm. Hey there, next up, a mission that's kind of unique, actually, and one that I really enjoyed when I was a kid. Let's see if we go over here. Jump! Jump! Come on, jump! Come on, man, jump! Oh, you shit. got it! Hey, what's happening? Who's the idiot? That's some washed up rapper. It's Mad Dog. Used to be a real chart tapping cat, real play. Mad Dog? Jump! Oh, man. Jump! Come on! He lost all his money in the casino and went bots him. Hey, Mad Dog! What you doing up there, fool? Come on, Come on Do I know you? Already. Don't be a wuss. I don't think so, Come so on, shut jump. the fuck up. <laughs> this is the end. Jump, it's over. Uh, oh, get, 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 no, get, dog! Get, get a grip, get dog! Get a grip! You still got it? You still gangster? I don't give a fuck no more. My manager got killed. Some asshole stole my rhyme book. Shit is rough. All the kids like this loco G or whatever the fuck his name is. Some fake ass gangster rapper bullshit. Liquor's my only friend. Yeah. 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 Come on, dog. You just need a new manager, baby. You looking at him? I hate y'all. Come in off that ledge, man. Hey, don't fuck him out of jumping. We got good money on this. Yeah, good odds too. Damn, this town is cold. Man, jump! Hey, Stay the fuck away! Stay the fuck away! I'm the best rapper in the universe! I'll jump! I'll jump! Oh, oh, hell no! no. I gotta catch this fool! Right. So, quickly now. Gotta get that pickup truck. Truck. Yeah, look, I don't have time for that right now. Gotta save a washed up rapper. A little more action. Stay back.
Jump, it'll save your career. It's time. I'm gonna do it. All right, now quickly, we're going to the hospital. Time to take your sorry ass to rehab, you drunken idiot. Am I still the top rapper, dude? Best there ever was. Second to nobody else, homeboy. And the name's Carl. Thanks, Carl. <laughs> right, come on. I need more uh oh. Might have just killed him there. Unless. Come on. Damn it. Not the time for a pile up. There we go. Get yourself straightened out, then we can get you back in the studio. Carl. What? When I get clean, I'm gonna need a new manager. Thought I might look you up. Yeah, you do that, homie. There we go. Alright. Oh, wait. First, a phone call. what you gotta say i ain't interested in a stupid game stupid games this is my heart you play with what look you damn gotta change my number i'm still insane as always hello carl been a long time huh yeah i was starting to miss you guys now why don't i believe you? get over here now, things have developed since the last time we met. Despite our best efforts, the gig's nearly up. I'm sure you'll find some way to keep your badge. Your kind always do. You still don't get it, do you, Carl? This ain't about keeping some fucking badge. Hey, listen to the man. We all the same, Carl. You, me. We all trying to pull ourselves out of the hole. Somebody steps on me, I gotta step on you. Where's Hernandez with that fucking meat? He's been gone too long, Tenpenny. <laughs> Getting a little edgy, fellas. <coughs> how you like that, you piece of shit? <coughs> that give you any idea how edgy I am? <coughs> Get up, bitch! You paying attention? Now, there's a ruined town out west of here. Aldea Malvada. And there's some piece of shit DEA officer meeting with an FBI agent with a dossier. Now you get the dossier and you make both of them disappear. Right. Gotta grab the dossier. And clear up more loose ends for ten penny. Now, in theory, right, could I just, you know, grab the helicopter here, take care of those guys this way? Because that'd be kind of hilarious. Because they're obviously up, up high, so... Let's see if we can use some military-grade weapons against these guys. I will try to get away. No, you're not. Oh, right, wrong helicopter. Damn it. Okay, 
Oh, this is fine. Just chase after the guy. Not an issue. I'll just use those guns instead. What shit, where is he? Yep. Okay, not going as smoothly as I'd hoped. Okay, he's right below me. Good, 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 good. Come on. Hoping I actually hit him once, so, you know, that'd be cool. I'm sure there was like a lock-on for this thing too, or maybe that's a different vehicle I'm thinking of. Seem to be hitting it. There we go. That one definitely hit. Okay. All I gotta do is just land this. And grab this. There we go. It could have been a lot smoother, but you know what? At least I got a cool helicopter chase out of it. Alright. Let's see if I can help out Woozy a bit more. Mr. Ronfa Lee. <clears throat> Gentlemen, can I have your marks, please? Gentlemen, or shall I say partners? Mm. Oh, I drank to that. And phone call. Hello? Carl, it's me, Ken. The Leone family has made their move. Salvatore's here. Now, he's taking over Caligula. We're screwed. It's war for control of Venturis, man. War. War. There's word of some triad visitors, something that should keep them busy. I'm calling from the bathroom. I gotta go. I really gotta go. Right. So Ken's in a spot of trouble. Because so we've properly settled into San Fier uh, into Las Venturas at this point. I've done, I think, like the first half of all the missions here. I think we should call it a part here. Next time, we're going to continue out helping Ken and also helping out Woozy. We're also going to see how we can deal with the mob in Las Venturas. And maybe we'll even hear more from Mad Dog. But that's all for next time. For now, I just want to say thank you all for watching. This has been DTS Andreas, 100% completion master safe, and I'll see you all next time.